Back in medieval times, if you got stealing or murdering or whatever it was, they'd make a show of you. And then as you made your way down to be home to this, the hangman would offer you a final drink. However, if they beat you so badly you couldn't walk or stand up, they'd put you on the wagon and wheel you down. But they wouldn't offer you a drink if you were on the wagon. That was a very interesting, albeit irrelevant, story. Timmy Thomas got a tip on a horse tomorrow. I'll tell him. Misty Button, 35 to 1. It's a dead sir. A foregone conclusion. All you have to do is put the bet on. Brings you to win. We might take a little action with Joe over there, so we just might. 5,000 to be no more than 500. I didn't realize you were a mathematician, on, do you know what I mean? <laughs> Let's go in there, watch this godforsaken horse lose this race, leave with the other nine grand. Oh, Misty Button! Deal? Misty Button, Misty Button wins it! That money didn't belong to Timmy Thomas. Doesn't look like Timmy Thomas has 10 grand to be betting on horses. Who did it belong fuck to? Fucking Alonzo. Who the fuck is Alonzo? <laughs> Everything all right? You work for me now. We don't even know how to use a gun. It's easy. You see this? Pull it back a tad. He's on the way. Jimmy Thomas is logistic. Oh, for fuck's sake, he's gonna get us fucking killed. Seriously, I've got nothing on In the merry month of June, from me home I started, left the girls of tombs, so I'm nearly broken hearted, saluted father dear, kissed me darling mother and drank a pint of beer, me grief and tears just rather than off to reap the corn, leave where I was born, cut a stout by corn, a banished ghost of goblins, brand new pair of brogues rattling o'er the bogs, fragment of... Good luck, man. Where are you going? I'm the getaway driver, I have to stay with the car. That's bullshit. Where do you get to drive? Because you're shit-faced drunk, Owen. So I'm sober enough to go shit this prick in the head, but I'm too drunk to drive. <laughs>